Hello! This video is a brief demonstration of the Biology 202 Sakai site. It is specific to the Bio 202 site and assumes that you're already familiar with general Sakai navigation. If you've never used Sakai before, I strongly recommend that you also watch my other video, which gives an introduction to that general navigation of Sakai as a whole. When you click on the Bio 202 page, this is the, our main page. You can get to all of the information you need except your grades by clicking on the syllabus tool over here in the left hand toolbar. And you will notice that some of these titles of the tools may be different from the titles of other courses um, that you've used Sakai for. So that's one reason this video is very important. So if you click here on the syllabus tool, you'll see right at the top of the syllabus page some important class information. This is the only place you can access this important information. So even if uh, for the rest of the semester you access information uh, from a different source, uh, be sure here right now at the beginning you check out this important information. It's got course information which can contains uh, the grading scheme and all uh, rules for the course. We've got our lecture and lab schedule, information on what textbooks you need and where to get them, the learning objectives for the course as a whole, our course exam regrade policy, and a link to important lab information which includes several important documents about the labs. After the important information, you see there's just a list of each week of the semester with a link to the lab for that week and all the lectures for that week. If you click on the link to one of the lectures, you've got the learning objectives for that, that lecture, the readings for that lecture, a link to the pre-lecture quiz, and a link to the PowerPoint for that lecture and these should all be available before lecture begins so if you want to print out the slides to take notes on that's available for you and if you click on the pre-lecture quiz link it takes you right to that pre-lecture quiz in Sakai. Similarly if you click on the lab link though none of them are ready yet uh, so I can't show you but there will be announcements for lab that week a link to the lab handout that you need to print out and any other information you need for that week, including links to any lab assignments that are due that week or the next week. Besides the important class information, you can get to all of this information also from the calendar, which you can go to by clicking on the calendar tool on the left-hand menu bar, or right here from the home page, you've got a calendar right here. So for the second day of class. There's your pre-lecture quiz and again that link will take you almost in two steps directly to the pre-lecture quiz in Sakai and back the le lecture link again two clicks takes you to exactly that same page that you saw from the syllabus and similarly, if you have lab that day, you can click on that and that will take you to the lab page for that week. I've got multiple labs because Sakai thinks I'm signed up for all of the lab sections. So that's right here on the home page, or you can get the same thing from the calendar page. Besides either the syllabus or the calendar, you can get to everything else you need from the gradebook, which will show you all your grades. Another way to get to things like pre-lecture quizzes, problem sets, and lab assignments is from the assessment tool. So I clicked assessments here on the left-hand toolbar, and that would take you right to any assessments that are currently open for you to take. I believe your page will look slightly different than this. Um, because even though it thinks I'm looking at this like a student, it's, it's showing me a bit of the faculty page here. So those are your most important things. 
Other than that, other things we have here for you is a link that will take you to all of the lectures that have already been recorded, so uh, past lectures. I can't show you anything yet since we don't have any lectures recorded yet email tool that will let you email some selection of this, not quite sure what yours will look like. Um, email archive is very useful. All of the emails that get sent out to the entire class will be uh, archived here, so if you deleted something by accident you can find it here. Staff information page has contact information, to the faculty and TAs for this course. Section info shows you which TAs teach which sections. Announcements is an archive of all of the announcements that have been made. Current announcements are also available there on the home page. Link to our YouTube channel where videos such as this one are. And site info will just give you some really basic information about um, the about the Sakai site and which um, which sections you're a member of, basically. And that's it. I hope you have a great semester, and I will see you in class.